What's up friends? Welcome back to my channel. For today's video I'm going to be doing an unboxing. So originally I wasn't planning on doing an unboxing for these packages, but one of them I had really 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 awesome customer service so I figured I might as well talk about it and share my experience with you. So this first package that I'm gonna open is for the women out there. So a lot of you may or may not have heard of something called The Pill Club. If you go to their website, it's thepillclub.com. Um, you can basically get your birth control prescription mailed to you every single month. So that way you just set it up for your year or whatever, and then you don't even have to worry about it. I figured I would try that. It's a lot easier to just have it mailed to you, especially if it's free shipping. I was served an ad on Facebook for The Pillow Club. So I clicked on it, checked it out, and it was actually really simple to sign up. Super easy, so you can actually have a current prescription that you put into the website and get your prescription that way, or you can have your doctor um, send in your current prescription or you can send in all your insurance information and all this other stuff and then they will get you set up like the actual the pillclub.com will get you set up with a prescription so i actually just switched insurance stuff um if you saw my last video i talked about how i was in insurance limbo for like six months and it was kind of crazy so my insurance actually just started at the beginning of this month I haven't had time to get to a doctor yet or make an appointment. All I had to do was send them like my height, weight, my insurance information, my blood pressure stuff. I had an issue on my account and so I there's actually a phone number you can call or text to and I didn't have to wait for anybody, like somebody answered right away. Um, his name's Navid. He's super awesome, super helpful, very nice, and got me all situated, um, fixed the issue with my account. And then from that point on, they kind of just text you updates about where they're at with your prescription, when your prescription should be sent out to you, and basically it's a step-by-step -step, like text. They'll just like shoot you a quick text and be like, hey, like we're taking care of this, blah, blah, blah and Navid was nice enough to make sure that they didn't put through my prescription until October 1st when my insurance actually kicked in so that was awesome he made a note on my account and then he personally had texted me through the pill club text line thing and said like hey I took care of this for you I'm gonna make sure that it gets in right away so that you can get your prescription as quick as possible and so the whole process was super easy super simple and really wonderful customer service and I actually just got it in the mail today and it comes in a really cute colored bubble mailer so that was kind of cool I was like okay I want to get this and do an unboxing about it because I just wanted to talk about it and the amazing customer service I received. Comes with a bunch of different goodies. What is this? A towelette. That's cute. It comes with the actual birth control, so that's good. That was the entire reason why I needed it. And it also comes with a chocolate. Apparently, um, I read somewhere that they were not sending the chocolates out in the summertime to California and other places that are really hot because the chocolates were all just getting really melty. So I'm excited that I actually got the chocolate in this one. Cora, this must be a feminine pad. More birth control. Apparently they send it in three months spurts, so that's good. Then I don't have to get a package every single month. A body cloth, so that must be similar to this guy. And then, oh, this is probably my favorite part besides the actual birth control. It just says you are magical. Oh, I love it. Well, who doesn't want a free sticker with their birth control like every three months? This girl does, I do. Okay, cool. That's that's everything that was in here. How fun is that? Just getting your birth control sent to you because you know, birth control is just not that fun. This might be TMI for all the guys out there, but the girls can probably relate to this. The reason why I went on birth control is actually because my periods are out of control. When I'm not on birth control, they will last for like 10 to like 13 days. And the first like four or five days are really heavy. 
and I recently tried to go off of birth control like last year and I was off of it for three or four months and I was losing my mind. It was messing with my productivity, I was cramping really bad and it just, I felt like I was always on my period for like that three or four month span. So I was like, I can't do this anymore. Like. It's not allowing me to be as successful as I would like to, which unfortunately that is something that a lot of women have to deal with. It's like sometimes you're put out of commission because of your period, and I'm, I'm thankful that I found a solution that works for me, so. I would really prefer not to be on it just because it's one of those things that you read about all the hormones and all this other random stuff going into your body and it's not natural, but Ultimately, you have to pick like the lesser evil and for me and my career and trying to be successful Definitely need to be on it. So that's Story guys if you want to tune back in or if I lost you forever. I am so sorry Ladies, I'm sure you can uh, relate. Oh, yeah, and we're just gonna say uh, I love chocolate What is this milk chocolate and blue bottle coffee? Oh my gosh, it has coffee in it like these are my things. This is my life right here. They know me. That was thepillclub.com. I highly recommend them to any women who are on birth control. The Pill Club was awesome. Super cool. Okay, for the second half of this video, I am going to do an unboxing of stuff I bought from Amazon. So, boom. Oh, boom. There we go. We got the Amazon thing. So this box is really heavy. I kind of forgot what I, like everything that I bought, but I know that I bought some really cool stuff, so I'm excited. All right, this box is a mixed bag, basically. Oh my gosh, there's so many random things. Okay, what is this? Recently, I've been looking into more natural ways to deodorize my apartment, especially the bathroom. Our apartment is not brand new. It's not newly remodeled. It's not like terrible or anything, but it's obviously been used for many, many years. So our bathroom kind of has like a weird smell to it. It has since we moved in. I deep cleaned it. It still has a weird smell. Don't know where the weird smell is coming from. So I figured instead of using like aerosols, like um, Febreze and all that jazz, like that I would try to find a natural way to take care of that. And so I purchased from this company called California Home Goods. I purchased this through Amazon. And these are natural bamboo charcoal, like little, is it sachets, sachets? I've never known how to pronounce that. Um, I might have to look it up, but we're gonna open this guy. Um, these are super cute. I love them. Okay, so these are like little air purifying bags. So it says it absorbs odors, bacteria, harmful pollutants, and allergens, and it prevents mold, mildew, and excess moisture. They're eco-friendly, non-toxic, and reusable. So basically, these guys, I like that it has like a little hole in it too, but these guys you can put in different areas in your apartment, house, wherever, even your shoes, I read that you could put them in your shoes to deodorize them. And then they'll take the, de the deodor, <laughs> they'll take the odor out of whatever it is that you're trying to deodorize. I got the, I believe it's called the Complete Home Set. So it came with four different things. So this is one of them. These, are, these must be the ones that you can put in your shoes. Like this is a lot smaller. So it came with two of those. This is kind of weird. The duck. They make like a funny sound when you squish them. Oh, and here's this one, the big boy. I didn't realize this was gonna be so gigantic. I think this one might be the one that I put in the bathroom. It's kind of cute. I like that it's a little triangle, like hangs. But yeah, California Home Goods, um, really reasonably priced. I don't ex remember the exact amount that I paid for these, but I think it was like 12 to 15 dollars ish and it came with all of this so worth it so maybe I'll do another like little review video on this later just to talk about whether or not it works but I've read a lot of reviews on Amazon and I believe they work so fingers crossed that they do because this would be totally awesome because it's all natural you're not spraying stuff into the air you're not using an aerosol can you're not depleting the ozone layer so everyone wins even the environment <laughs> okay so this next thing that I'm going to open up is actually a lot of fun 
So, since I moved out to California, I've kind of become slightly obsessed with this thing called boba tea or bubble tea. So, I figured, I was like, okay, I'm spending like $4.50 per drink. I mean, it's like equivalent of like buying a Starbucks latte or whatever. But still, like, I don't want to spend a ton of money on something that I could potentially make myself at home. So, I bought boba, like those uh, black tapioca pearls. Supposedly I can make this at home. So this is what boba, the boba pearls look like. People are probably most familiar with tapioca or like tapioca pudding. It's kind of like that except these are like large black balls. <laughs> Get your minds out of the gutter, people. <laughs> But these are just like the larger black tapioca. Hopefully be able to make these. It says it's ready in five minutes. That's pretty quick. But yeah, I've been all about like making this stuff at home. Like if I really like something, like I'll try to make it at home because it saves you a lot of money. And this last thing that I got is actually really awesome as well. This box is like really fancy. It looks like Christmas. This is Lavoit. I don't know if that's if I'm pronouncing that correctly, but I got a natural Himalayan salt lamb, lamb, salt lamp, and it's called, this is the Kyra version. And what's really cool about this is that it has a little base to it. It's like a metal base that the, the Himalayan salt lamp actually sits on. And then it has like a little dimmer switch, which is something that I haven't seen in a salt lamp before. So I thought that was really awesome. The reason why I bought this is because I'm creating a fun little reading nook for myself. Just like a cozy little area where I can just like sit down and read a book for like half hour because that's all I can muster for free time. Especially now that I'm doing my vlogs again. Just kidding. The vlogs don't take a terrible amount of time, as long as I have an idea of what I want to do. It says, thank you, we hope you love it. Really, would a bonus one year warranty make you smile? Yeah, probably. So you get a bonus one year warranty, you just have to register it within 14 days of my purchase. This is cute. Home goals, right there. But yeah, so it's just the Lavoit natural Himalayan salt lamp and this is Kyra version. Look at how cool this is, I love it. The whole idea behind the natural Himalayan salt lamps is the fact that they are made from like the salt caves in Pakistan. So if you're getting a Himalayan salt lamp and it's not from Pakistan, it's not real. The idea behind the Himalayan salt lamp is the salt lamp actually attracts water molecules um, from the surrounding area in the environment and then absorbs those molecules as well as other pollutants and dust and all that other nasty stuff that's in the air. And then it brings it into the salt crystal. And then once the um, salt lamp is warmed, the water evaporates back into the air. Um, and then the trapped dust, pollen, and smoke, etc., just gets trapped in the lamp. So that's how it deodorizes and kind of cleanses the air. So that's like the layman term science behind it. That's kind of why I like salt lamps. Plus they look super dope when they're lit up and in your apartment or room. There's just vibes about it. Anyways, this one is kind of cool because it's in, it came in a vacuum sealed little pouch here, but as you can see, it's a pretty good size uh, salt lamp. I don't remember how big it is. What are the, the specs on this bad boy? It doesn't say. I think this one's five to eight pounds though. But yeah, each Himalayan salt lamp is super unique. Um, it has a unique shape to it and no two salt lamps look the same, which is kind of what I like about it. I already own one other salt lamp, which I got from the salt room Appleton. Thank you, Cheryl. I would get another one from the Salt Room Appleton, but that's always really hard for me to like travel from Wisconsin um, to California with it. I just don't know if I'd be able to put it in my suitcase. So that's why I just ordered one and had it shipped because that's usually a lot easier. And like I said, this one has a dimmer, which is really, really cool. And I'm excited to test it out. So maybe I'll do a little video about it for later. 
Anyways, that was my unboxing video. I hope you enjoyed this video. If you liked it, hit the like button. And if you haven't already, hit subscribe so you don't miss out on all of my future videos. And I'll see you in the next video. Bye! Oh, and if you want to purchase any of the items that I talked about in this video, I will have them linked down below. So check that out in the description. Thank you.